L.A., Chicago, mm -hmm. New York. Right. When you think of the cities around the nation with traffic troubles, Milwaukee might not come immediately to mind. Yeah, but a new report points out a huge trouble spot in the Bruce City, but did they pick the wrong road? Fox 6 is Christina Head with tonight's big story. You gotta stop and go right if you're taking I-94 westbound traffic flows from downtown over towards Mitchell Boulevard. And of course, you're bottlenecking through that stadium interchange and it looks like heavy traffic clears out just past the Miller Park area. It's like the afternoon rush hour is starting to wind down. Just Mike Conway knows traffic. I'm well versed in the Milwaukee area roads. I'm Mike Conway. Before you head out, you can see the In fact, you can hear him at MilwaukeeOldies.com. Just about anywhere. 97.3 The Brew. on your radio dial. You can see your drive online. Even though talking traffic is his thing, a new traffic study was released that even surprised him. According to the Daily Beast, out of 75 cities ranked for the worst commutes, I-94 at the Stadium Interchange ranked 34th. Well, you think of you know heavy traffic areas like New York and L.A. and Chicago even in this area. According to the study, the weekly hours of bottleneck congestion on I-94 is 50 hours. The worst stretch is I-94 westbound at exit 308. Cars traveling in the thick of the congestion only go about 18 miles per hour. I mean, you got to stop and go right if you're taking I-94 westbound traffic flows from downtown to the stadium interchange. Conway again was surprised, but would tend to agree with the study's Parking. findings. I don't know why it happens. I guess there's just not enough lanes there, or people are merging left and right and trying to get off. And uh, I'm not sure why it backs up, but every afternoon we see a big bottleneck trying to get past Miller Park. As you can see, it's pretty much smooth sailing right now, but of course it's not the morning or evening commute times right now. Now, Conway says that if he had to pick a second hot spot for the area, he would say 45 headed southbound between Capitol and I-94. He says it's very congested there every single day during the afternoon commute. Now, the Department of Transportation says that the zoo interchange is the busiest interchange in Wisconsin. They say it's the busiest. However, they do not call it the most congested. Live in Milwaukee, Christina Head, Fox 6 News. Some travelers may disagree, but we'll leave it up to interpretation. Christina, thanks.